So how are you guys? Good. Yes, Good. my name is Tony Gonzalez. I'm from Made in Metal, Spain, but I'm from Cuba. You were in Cuba maybe two years ago. So my question is, it was funny, happy, did you enjoy it? Will you repeat the experience, sorry, to go again to Cuba? Well, um, I got to say, uh, for a lot of us, for most of us, it was a dream come true because Cuba's always been a place we always wanted to go. Uh, and to have the opportunity to go there and play music for the local people, it was amazing. We left with the glass full, if you will. We, we, uh, we realized uh, more than ever that music does make a big difference sometimes, you know. And uh, coming here to Hellfest has been uh, nothing but a great experience. So uh, we'll return here and we'll return to Cuba whenever it's possible. I think there's, uh, we're trying to make arrangements to get there, right? Yeah, it was, uh, it was uh, an experience of a lifetime for me. It was uh, outstanding. The people were, were just wonderful. And it just shows you what a bridge music can be between people. Yes, I had a great time as well. I thought the people were amazing. The fans were insane. I was very surprised at how many uh, like Guns N' Roses shirts and Iron Maiden and stuff that we saw. But the fans were amazing. The food was amazing. The island. And you have great drinks as well. The rum. Forget it. Awesome. Here. Hello. Hi. Hello. My name is Jean from Radio Panic, Brussels. Uh, the question is uh, tonight to Marco. Yes. Marco, the, during the past, you played with several bands. I, I remember Blue Murder, Thin Lizzy, White Snake, uh, Dol with Dolores. And Cherry Lewis, too, yes. yeah. But anyway. uh, did you receive uh, many suggestions to play with uh, the different uh, bands? Uh, suggestions, you mean? Uh, did I? Yeah, you know, I was. You had uh, a famous think, experience. Yeah, great experience, and very honored to get a call like, you know, like that to play with those bands. I happen, I happen to live in L.A., and I think part of it was that um, I happen to be at the right place at the right time, to be honest. There's a lot of players in L.A. You're meeting the right people, the, the right circles of people, and the opportunity comes, and you try to be pro. You know, you show up on time, you prepare yourself, you do your homework, you leave a good card, and uh, every, people call you again. Great experience, but i got to say, the culmination of my career, and I'm not just saying this, this band right here is the top of the line. I mean, playing with these cats right here, with Doug and Brian and John and David, it's, uh, for me, like a dream come true. If I could put a band together, this is the band. And so here I am in the middle of it, and we're having a blast. Absolutely. Right? Thank you. You're welcome. I mean that. There? Hi. Couple questions for Marco. Hi, the uh -oh. fuck are you? I'm, I'm good. How are you, brother? Mark. Mark, good, good to see you, brother. I haven't seen you in a while. Yes, sir. Um, you play a couple of cover versions in the sets. Yeah. And as a band, you've had a couple of albums out. When are you going to drop the cover versions and just do a dead dizzy set? That's a great question. I think one of the guys, you guys could answer that. Yeah, please. Honestly, the, the reason why we do it is uh, it's not for a lack of material, obviously. We've got... Uh, four records and an EP. Um, we actually enjoy doing it, and we all grew up with a lot of the classic rock bands of the 70s, and if you go and you look at a lot of those bands like Zeppelin, Humble Pie, um, Aerosmith, they all did, a lot of them did cover songs. And yeah, the Stones, the Beatles. Um, so this is just our way of, of uh, introducing a newer audience, a new audience, to some of the bands that we grew up listening to, kind of a tip of the hat. So, um, you know, we're, we're having fun. That, that's, that's it, that's all it, you know, there's really no rhyme or reason to it. That's the reason why we do it. Hello? Don't yell. <laughs> <laughs> no use. So you all travel all the world with different projects and different bands, and uh, you're all about I would see the same image and the same picture, but I was uh, I would like to ask Duke. You you've been doing quite a lot of projects for the last few years, few years for Revolution Saints, for uh, for example, which I like quite a lot. And uh, I would like to know if with the Dead Aces you found a way to to play music in a in a more organic way this time. If you find if everything finds into place now, if you feel well in this band. Yeah, absolutely. Um, it's 
you know, as Marco said, this is a, this is a really great band, but it's also we're all friends. You know, we've I've known um, obviously I worked with Brian and and Marco and White Snake and John and I have known each other since we were kids in school. So we we didn't ever make music together, but um, but we've been friends and I've always followed his career and I've always loved his singing, and um, and then David and I completely hit it off. We just it's been uh, it's been very it feels great, you know. When I I was very dedicated to White Snake for a long time, and um, after stepping away and clearing my head, this is the perfect thing for me to uh, to be doing. Thanks. Bear. Question for Doug. Doug, you played with um, two of my personal musical heroes, Ronnie James Dio, Dave Coverdale, um, to the most incredible vocalist. In, in the rock genre of all time. Is there anybody else that you would like to play with? Um, you know, you know, I don't really think about it, but there's a there's a lot of great there's a lot of great musicians that are that are out there and uh, playing different kinds of music. You know, it's really cool to see um, somebody like Lady Gaga doing her thing with Metallica and. Um, uh, but you know, I've been very lucky regarding singers. And I, I love working with John, um, and it's, uh, you know, like Brian said, Steven Tyler's not too shabby either. Okay, thanks. First of all, we want to thank you all, first of all, for all your interest and taking time to come out and talk to us. Remember, we need your support. Don't stop. If you want us around, we are ready to be around, but we need your support. So spread the word, all right? Live and louder. Merci beaucoup. Au revoir bientôt.